<laughs> we have a one seven four. No, it's easy dot, but it's never shown up. But this is the people stealing from you right here. One seven four. Here it shows up as explore. Right there. So isn't it just a little bit suspicious that this can show up as so many things and has an active connection anytime it pleases and can choose and go through any file it wants and upload any file it wants. And nobody cares to help nobody cares to help victims of this theft. They are stealing your products, your designs, your hard work, and they are making millions. When you look at something online, you see something on TV, you see something on clothing, you see a new design on the desktop app, a new icon. It might actually be yours. You might think, well, that looks an awful lot like mine. But no, when it comes down to it, it might be these people behind it stealing it because there is money in graphic design. If there wasn't, there would be no jobs for it, right? There would be nobody in that field. There would not be the thousands of websites where you can sell your designs on. If you pay a membership fee, you can sell your designs. But all of those sites have the same exact designs created by a million different people. It's copyright infringement. They're not being created by anybody but the one person they were stolen from. And no company has a regulation that says, we need proof of your system specs. We need proof that it came from you, your computer name, blah, blah, blah. Nobody will help you because it's making everybody else the money. Why the hell would the government care? Your kids are next. You're my, you might be a victim today, but when your kids grow up, they're next ones. And nobody will stop it in the meantime. One day, maybe... Our lawmakers will get their heads out of their asses and look and think that they need to extend the copyright laws from three years to 50 years. I don't care because people are, uh, as long as there's going to be internet, people are going to be victimized, period. You have any and everything stolen and there's only certain laws in place. Every time there's a new theft or a new breach, a new this, they need to be writing new laws so that way they have stronger laws in place, stronger regulations, and companies will have to monitor what's going on. But they don't care. Anyway, I keep all my finished art on a flash drive. I discovered this 174 IP address, which changes names to any and every program you have open. This is hack. This is the work of a hacker. They are using, or actually, it's the IP address that I caught still in my work is registered to um, Princess. LLC, and I look it up, and it is a store, a data collection site established in 2006. So they've been using 
whatever they've been claiming to be data collection since 2006. But what are they doing? They're using your property. They're not collecting it. And even if they were, they have no rights to go into your pictures. No rights to go into your library. No rights to go into your video. No rights to steal your creations. And we can't block this through our firewalls. There's no way, no how. And Microsoft has supposedly created this Windows 10 as hacker proof. Well, I'm sorry to inform you, I'm on Windows 10 right now. <laughs> if it was all they claim it was, they would not be able to find anything on either of my drives. I'm just frustrated. <clears throat> My kid wants to grow up to be a programmer. He wants to grow up to make video games. <clears throat> and you know what it goes into video games. What if he grows up and he tries to do this from his home device, not protected by any networks, any corporations? All his property can be stolen and somebody else will get rich off of it. All my property is being stolen and somebody else is getting rich off of it. This is against the law. It is absolutely 100% against the law. There are so many different laws. They're breaking the fact that they're used, stealing it to use. Here we are. They're back. And I'm just getting fed up with this. I'm tired of pleading with people to care. My son is 13. How old's your child? What's your child creating on their computers? <clears throat> what are they making at school? This is one of the unknown threats. And if it's not come, being reported by a corporation, who cares? And if, if it is happening to corporations, they don't know. All these people that sit around and claim that there are work using peer-to-peer -peer sites their network's breached right there if this is actually a legitimate firm which it cannot be for data collection what are they stealing from your corporations 